that our music has led us to countries all around the world and that's what we wanted to do. Theo, Adam, um, with this new band, uh, Hers, what, uh, what things can you now express that you could not, that could not have been done before with can your other bands? We can express pain In what way? sadness. Yeah. In a way that men can't most days and most times. Men can be happy every day of the week. But, uh, but yeah, it's useful. Very useful. Otherwise, we'd go crazy, I think. <laughs> it's like going to a psychologist. <laughs> it's like a therapy. Does now it really feel for you that way, your music as, a, as, as therapy? It helped us escape the music, which was important, because it, when we had our lives were really boring, we couldn't even afford to go to the pub or anything. So we'd just sort of sit in a, in a, a flat and write these songs that, that took us away from that life. So, so yeah, they were, they were important at that, at that point. And, um, yeah. We need to do it. We, we, we lost when we don't, we don't have to, anything to do. Our brains start to, we start to overthink everything. The second album we're gonna, because we used to be unhappy, <coughs> now we're quite happy. <coughs> second album we're just gonna decline into <laughs> misery, call, it, call the album Depression. <laughs> Hurts, Depression, album two. That sounds, like, that's, yeah. that sounds like a good idea. Third album, yeah. Happiness, again. Okay. Yeah, because what, what's so boring about Manchester then? That's, no, Manchester's not boring actually, it's the most, one of the most exciting places to live, but l like London and like, like most big cities, if you've got no money, it's the worst place to be because there's so many opportunities to do things, but you can't do them if you've got no money. So. But it's a great place, very important for the music, Manchester. It's been very important for, for well, well, it's because we where we met each other and where we learned how to do things, but there's an atmosphere there that's, that's very important. Yeah, because there's always uh, yeah, a buzz about Manchester because there are some great bands that, mm. that hail from there. But how do you incorporate su such a feeling into your music? I, I think w the common thread between Manchester bands is ambition. All of them made really ambitious music, Joy Division, especially bands like Oasis. They just Oasis come from a tiny little place near where I live called Burnage, and it's just nothing. But they made this music that was so widescreen and ambitious and they tried to look beyond Manchester and I think all bands in the kind of folklore of Manchester music have done that mm. and I, I think that's what we're trying to do as well we're trying to you know our music has led us to countries all around the world and that's what we wanted to do yeah we were talking about having no money that's why uh, such a place can be born but is it is it uh, difficult to keep yourself motivated if you're uh, yeah to make, I don't know how Poor yeah, no, so it's so difficult. It's very difficult. But that's why you dress up smart. If you wear suits and you dress smart, you feel like every day you're kind of doing something important with your life. So it's um, it's important, but you've got to just you, you can't stop really. You've just got to, you've just got to not give up and just keep going and going and going. And and we've been been through a lot of different things, and we've been through different bands. And uh, I think if you believe in what you do, if you don't believe in it, no one else is going to. So it's, you've got to do that first. So dressing up nice is a way, it's a, so some sort of a pep talk for yeah. yourself. Yeah, it's denial. <laughs> denial from where you actually came from. Yeah. yeah.